Some things were so necessary that it would be hard to believe they could ever disappear. But time has a funny way of erasing things from our daily lives. These objects are very familiar to us all, but in most cases, they have been obsolete for years. So let's look at some of the things that were commonplace way back when, but are now obsolete. Boom boxes were iconic music players known for their large side speakers and portable design. They allowed individuals to carry their favorite songs with them, utilizing cassette tapes as the primary medium for music playback. But they also could be tuned to a radio station. Before the widespread adoption of smartphones, boom boxes were emblematic of urban culture. But they were also in just about every young person's bedroom in suburbia. Newspaper ads, specifically classifieds, served as a precursor to the modern online dating platforms that so many single people rely on today. These personal ads provided a dedicated forum for people to seek love, companionship, or friendship that reflected the social dynamics and dating norms of their time. Remember, newspapers used to litter driveways across America before being replaced by the internet. Rediscover your past by digitizing your family's memories with Legacy Box. Watch until the end of this video to find out more about preserving your legacy, and then visit LegacyBox.com recollection. Punch clocks were a mechanical timekeeping device that was commonly used in workplaces to record employees' work hours. With a distinctive ka-chunk sound, these clocks punched a timestamp on the card and tracked the start and end times of each shift. While these were found in just about every workplace a couple of decades ago, punch clocks have largely been replaced by digital systems with card scanners. Camera film was the primary way we captured and preserved images before the digital revolution transformed photography. Film consisted of a flexible plastic base, and it was coated with light-sensitive emulsion, which required careful processing and development to produce the photographs. Drugstores alone were big developers of photos, and they sold a massive amount of film. But the wall of old-school camera film has all but disappeared, and has been replaced by a wall of charging accessories for your phone. Answering machines revolutionized personal communication by allowing callers to leave a message even if the person wasn't home. These devices, connected to a landline telephone, recorded incoming messages onto a small cassette tape, which allowed it to be listened to at a later time. While answering machines have gone the way of home landlines, the concept itself is still used through voicemail on smartphones. Answering machines have played a significant role in shaping both communication norms and caller expectations. Travelers' checks once provided a secure and convenient method for travelers to carry money abroad. These checks were issued by banks or financial institutions and could be exchanged for local currency at currency exchange offices or other merchants worldwide. Most people used travelers' checks to protect their cash in case of theft or loss. But since the heavy use of credit cards and other forms of digital payments through applications on your phone, travelers' checks have slowly vanished, but most are still redeemed if you have some hidden away. Let's face it, TV shows have changed quite a bit since streaming began. Laugh tracks, which were very heavily used, were pre-recorded audience reactions inserted into television sitcoms to enhance comedic timing and create a sense of live audience response. Although all the major networks use them, they have become a thing of the past with modern television production, as most viewers perceive the pre-recorded sounds as artificial and sometimes intrusive. Mercury thermometers were widely used for taking your temperature before concerns about mercury toxicity led to their decline. These thermometers contained a column of mercury that expanded or contracted with changes in temperature, providing an accurate measurement of thermal energy. Today, digital thermometers have replaced the mercury ones, and these use heat sensors to determine temperature rather than mercury. Telex machines were electromechanical teleprinters used for sending written messages over long distances before the use of email and internet messaging. These telex machines operated using telegraph networks and they transmitted text-based communications using electrical signals and mechanical printing mechanisms. 
Often, messages were charged by the letter, so abbreviations would be used to save money. This was text talk before texting was a thing. While once essential for international communication, telex machines have been rendered obsolete by internet technologies. If you've stuck around this long, don't worry, there's still more. But I wanted to let you know that we have some retro merchandise available too. Just click the link in the description to head on over to the store. Tokens have been used for many purposes, including public transportation, vending machines, casinos, and arcades. Just think Showbiz Pizza and Chuck E. Cheese. These specialized tokens provided a more convenient and standardized way to pay, especially in situations where cash transactions were impractical. As digital payment methods came into existence, these physical tokens were largely replaced, and some have even become keepsakes or collector's items. We all remember Beta, VHS, and even DVDs, but Laserdiscs were considered the highest quality of home entertainment you could find. If you wanted to watch a Laserdisc, that meant you also needed a Laserdisc player, and these weren't cheap either. The Laserdisc movement was popular among home theater enthusiasts because they offered high-resolution video with superior audio. But the format's large size and limited titles led to its eventual demise, especially with the rise of HD DVDs. For most of us, this was how we were woken up each day for school or work. Alarm clocks not only displayed the current time, but they also could be programmed to set off an alarm at a time of your choosing. While these were once in every single household, alarm clocks have largely disappeared. We have the smartphone to thank for that, which has seemingly integrated itself into every aspect of our lives. Remember the feeling of being handed a set of keys for that new car you bought, or the new house you were moving into? The jingling of metal keys on a keychain was the primary way we unlocked a door or started the engine of a car for decades and decades. Despite their reliability, advancements in technology have led us to push buttons rather than inserting a key. Today, a key code or a Bluetooth phone is just as good as having those old metal keys, so that's one less thing you need to worry about losing. Finally, small portable TVs were once a big deal. These somewhat handheld devices allowed you to carry a television with you and watch TV as long as you had plenty of D batteries to load into it, or at the very least, access to a plug. During the 1970s and 1980s, portable TVs were a pretty popular way to stay entertained. And for some, that meant not missing a show while you were in the garage or even on a road trip. Today, portable TVs aren't needed because we all carry phones that stream content over the internet. Let me know in the comments if I missed anything, and make sure to sign up for the Recollection Road newsletter using the link in the description. Recollection Road and Legacy Box both believe it's important to preserve the past. If you're like me, there's a box of your family's treasured home movies and photos tucked away somewhere, and Legacy Box can help you preserve them digitally. The process is a simple and safe solution for converting your home movies and photos to thumb drive or to the cloud. Just send in your Legacy Box filled with old VHS and camcorder tapes, film reels, and pictures, and get back digital copies that can be easily enjoyed, shared, and kept organized. It's that easy. Legacy Box is trusted by over 1 million people, and it's all done right here in the USA. Get started preserving your past today. Go to LegacyBox.com slash recollection to get an incredible 55% off. Buy today to take advantage of this exclusive offer and send in your memories when you're ready. Go to LegacyBox.com slash recollection to save 55% while supplies last. If you enjoyed this video, consider watching the other videos in this series. While you're at it, hit subscribe and share Recollection Road with someone you know. As always, thank you so much for watching.